see, back when I was in school, the bullies wore actual skulls incorporated into their clothing because there wasn't technology yet to print complex designs on fabric, so you could only tell how tough someone was based on the amount of skulls they had. It's been like 10 years since I was bullied. I'm firmly in the realm of adulthood, and I've achieved all my wildest dreams. Yet I still somehow see myself as just that bullied kid, as the underdog, not realizing that actual kids could potentially see my videos. That's why Scrub Brush's comment about these skull-clad bullies really shook the cobwebs from my cold heart and warmed it with fire, inspiring me to accept my role as an elder to the Gen Z kids out there on YouTube, seeking the same refuge I once did. So come under my wing, birds. Young birds, I'll teach you to fly. If those skull punks walked up to me nowadays, I would use a much more elegant strategy. Oh, you like skulls, huh? You really like them? Uh, uh, ew, uh, stop, 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 stop it. Ew. You really like skulls? Oh, ew, no, stop, that's gross. Ew. You like skulls so much. Let's make those skulls a little more realistic. Uh, uh, Skulls, you shouldn't be wearing them. Ah, 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 you like skulls. Ah, ah, ah. Those bullies will never talk to you again, I promise. And you never even risk getting yourself in trouble. Any trauma they gave you will be reversed onto them tenfold. And you didn't even lay a finger on them, just a bit of your blood. <laughs> <laughs> yes, victory is for buff nips. After all these years, I thought I would not win, but I have in the end. Oh. <coughs>